Hey guys, this is Brian with Thunder Laser. Um, I had a question about how to use um, uh, the save RD file in Lightburn to actually uh, save a file to a thumb drive and use the laser untethered. So let me turn that off. I've got some artwork here. I'm just going to look at the preview, make sure that it looks right. Uh, I'll speed it up a little bit just to make sure everything's good. And drag it a little bit. Okay. Okay, perfect. So um, it's ready to go. Um, let me show this again. I'm in absolute coordinates. So I want to make sure that uh, I get it placed where I want it. I'll get it over here out of the way. And I'm just going to go to save RD file. And then I'm going to navigate to my USB drive um, and save it. And then we'll go over here and insert the drive. And then on the control panel, you'll want to go to the file button and then use your right arrow to go over to read memory file and then down to UDisk, hit enter. And you'll notice that read UDisk file is highlighted. Press enter, there's your file, press enter. I'm sorry, go back over, copy to memory, hit enter. It'll copy the file into the device's memory. And then you go back into file and there it is, and it'll pull it right up. I did that a little bit weird. I don't ever do it. That was my like second try ever, uh, but let me do this part again. <clears throat> so we're gonna back out. We're going to go to file, and that's already there, so let's take it back out. So it'll be the way it was. Okay, that's the way it was. Escape. So we're going to go to file after we insert our USB drive into the UDisk slot, and right arrow over, and then go down to UDisk, hit enter, and then read UDisk file will be highlighted. We'll hit enter. It'll read the file. Then we'll use the right arrow and the down arrow to go to copy to memory. We'll let it copy to memory. And then I think we can just escape. Now we're in the file memory. Wait, escape one more time. There we go. Now we're in the file menu and we have the preview. So we just make sure it's selected, hit enter, and it'll bring it up in the preview window, ready to run. So that's how that works. Uh, if you have any questions, you can just give us a call and we'll be glad to help. Thanks.